BLP Kosher Dreidel Bop. I saw this one was doing some numbers for one of his songs. You know, he usually do decent numbers. This one right here was doing a little bit better. So I figured it had to be something going on, something in the video or some type of, oh, I don't know. We're going to see. We're going to get into this. See what's going on. He hard. Pause. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Bro. Dreidel, man. Dreidel, man. Hit him with the bang. Not in the trend. I ain't gonna lie, first couple bars, I was about to say, uh, I don't know if I'm gonna like this one, but after the hook went a couple times, I should fuck with it. it. It is a little different. It's like the beat was definitely unexpected. And then the way he actually floating on it is way different than I would have thought to go with it. That's crazy. But it's hard, though. I ain't gonna lie, he actually, he pulled it together. I fuck with it. So far, 32 Water, seconds in. Let's see. The dreidel man I could. She <laughs> give me top in the forest. I'm in the neck of the woods. I feel like Blake. I'm a carpenter. How? By my porch, the dreidel man I could. She give me top in the forest. I'm in the neck of the woods. I feel like Blake, I'm a carpenter. How I ripped the wood. I got like 40. I'm gonna let that one go. I wish you would smoke with me. You bout the machine, or you could go to college. <laughs> thought he was wow. like that boy Kanye. He said he was from the O. You from Altamonte. They thought that I was Pee Wee. Now they fuck with me the long way. They told me stay up out the way. You bout to be a mo. Nigga, hold up. I'm trying to pause. Shout out Pee Wee Longway. He really wanted the ones. For real, for real. This nigga funny though. I ain't gonna lie. He got the one line. Is I fuck with this nigga. He said he was from the O. You from Altamonte. They thought that I was Pee Wee. Now they fuck with me the long way. They told me stay up out the way. You about to be a mogul. Dude in that interrogation room. He went to stretching vocals. I used to ask around for rides. Wow. Wow. Oh, oh, that was slick. He's saying a nigga was singing. Nigga, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, run it. So I'm hitting the mic and shit. Run it back. Room, he went to stretching vocals. I stay up out the way, you about to be a mogul. Dude in that interrogation room, he went to stretching vocals. I used to ask her. Oh, I ain't heard it like that before. You know, I, I had heard a lot of flips of the nigga singing and shit. That was a hard one. I like that. I like that. That's definitely up there for one of my favorite flips of the that's hard. That's hard. Hey, this one's come up. Dude in that interrogation room, he went to stretching vocals. I used to ask around for rides. I was never mobile. Now my pocket's <laughs> in Alabama because my money mobile. I'm fucked up. I... <laughs> Bro, that's thing I really be having lives. And I be seeing some of them coming like in the last show at the 2000s, baby joint or whatever. I think that's what it was called. The line about the dim sum. <laughs> that was one of the that the mobile the Alabama. That was one of the ones you see coming, but it's still hard. I still fuck with it. That's that's funny. That's super funny. But it's hard. Not funny like me. I was never mobile. Now my pockets stay on Alabama because my money mobile. I'm fucked up out the Middle East. I'm trying to make peace. And you ain't standing on bees, wax, birds, bees. I love my dog, but he'll crash like his peach beach. Because he got beef in every city like he Mr. Beast. They asked me how much for the feet. Man, that shit's steep. This chopper got me walking. Bruh. Every time I try to pause, he just keep rapping. You cannot stop this nigga. That's basically what I'm saying. It's happening right here. Look, listen. I got beef in every city like a Mr. Beast. I'm about to get up and walk out this room, nigga. Say something else. One more, one more of those and I'm out of here, nigga. What's happening here? See, now, now, now I'm trying to get to play. They don't even want to. Oh, no. What's going on right now? Hold on. Let's see. 
All right, we back on. Oh, no. What just happened? But let's get it. Oh, Juice Shicey was hard too. They thought I was spoon fed. Bitch, I had a sport. You try to take my ice, you meet the stick like I'm Bobby Orr. They thought I was spoon fed. I had a spork. What did I tell you was going to happen if you said something else? Did you not? Did you not think I was? I tried to slam the door. It it it, it didn't work. I, it, it didn't work. Okay, whatever. Look, listen. You got 40, 40, about 40 more seconds. We go see. What the fuck is this? Duh. I, just, I, I, did, I, I didn't know. The, nigga. <laughs> Hey, listen, I don't know what that is. Maybe I'll find out that that's some crazy, super rare collector's skateboard from some crazy artist. Nigga, what the? On your wall? It's one thing to have it, to put it on the wall on, as a display piece. That's making a statement, I ain't gonna lie. Ah, uh, oh, whoa. I'm not judging. Let's get on with the music. Here I even sleep on the Hero. floor like the furniture store. You don't hit your bitch right, bad cock and more. Hit him with the bangs, not in the train. I don't want to do this no more. You have 40 I'm seconds. I <laughs> fuck with this nigga heavy. Bruh, he said you hit your bitch from back cock and more. Bruh, duh. I fuck with this nigga. He really funny as hell, but he really hard though. Again, pause. He really hard though, but he can really, really rap. He can really skate. This nigga really got like, it's like a, like a more. What's the word I'm looking for? All they want to say authentic. That's the first word that came to mind. But that's not really what I'm looking for. But we'll use it as a placeholder for now. But like a more authentic Lil Dicky. Like Lil Dicky got funny bars. But his music seems like it's more on the parody side. <sighs> Don't want to say parody. We'll say parody for now. But Bill P. Coach, he got a lot of hard one-liners too. That's funny. But his music seems like it's more actual rap. Not Parody, funny, comedic shit. And maybe I'm wrong about Lil Dicky. I never listened to a Lil Dicky project. I only know the individual big songs or whatever. The show is hard. But that's kind of the same vibe I get with this thing. This nigga got some funny ass line. Shit that no other rapper is going to think to say. Especially now somebody one of these little street rappers. They would never think to say. Bad cock and more. Bro. 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 I said the nigga had 40 seconds. And I say nothing else crazy. He did it in about four, maybe. If I had to guess. I might have been a little off. Might have been three and a half. Listen, I'm just rambling at this point. Uh, I was about to say I'm about to record another video, but I'm not. I'm actually going to record tomorrow, so I don't know which one's coming next. But stay tuned for that one. In the meantime, check out that one over there. Thank you for watching. I'm gone.